Hello, family and friends. It's Steph Franklin. As you already know, or probably already know, all three of our children are on the autism spectrum. Our eldest, Alexander, and our twin daughters, Corey. We live in California, and in California we have vision disorders. And the Latterman Act is the laws that govern how adults and children with developmental delays have the opportunity to live the life that everyone else who's developed most and typical typically get to live. So, um, recently we requested through a regional center that they fund a camp that they had funded, not for us, but in years past they had funded and they stopped funding it. Um, I found an exemption in the Latterman Act, or so I thought, and uh, we applied under the Act. We are not exempt, and so they turned us down. And after that happened, I also found out that the Latterman Act is not being funded in the same way that it used to be, and that it's, it's actually critically underfunded. I don't know how I missed this in the three years that we've been on this journey, but the legislative process is a huge part of allowing the regional center to do its job. If the governor does not fund the regional center, then the regional center has no money to give out to its clients. And our children are clients. Um, this actually impacts everybody, not just our kids. Uh, in all honesty, our children are privileged to have parents who have figured a way to get the services that we feel are important, regardless if they're funded. Speech therapy, occupational therapy, physical therapy, adaptive summer camps, or adaptive community events. But for the children who don't have that privilege, they will still be in your children's general ed classroom with a teacher who's probably not prepared to handle those children's unique challenges and um, it's just kind of a snowball effect those kids are more likely to get into trouble in school um, worst case scenario end up in the criminal system not being productive members of society so at the end of this there will be a link I would like to ask you to please ask for um, the Latterman Act to be funded Understand if this isn't your life and this isn't your passion, you may not want to do it. Well, then please support the things you're passionate about, whether it is um, how education is done in our, in, in our society, uh, whether it is marriage equality, um, fair pay for men and women, like whatever your passion is, Please find out how you can legislatively support it, not just get on social networks and complain and not really do anything. And that's not a judgment. That's just, that's my vulnerable confession of how I didn't even really know how this was working and how it could impact my family. So thank you for your time and 